Terrorists to escape from the bus crash. Fine, lay it on me. I'm still at the station. Not a great place to talk. Uh, I'll meet you at Fort and Vickers.
the Civic Science Center today as an unidentified man scaled Seattle's iconic Space Needle and attached an enormous banner to its spire. And all the meaning of the flag symbol and the identity of the banner man both remain mysteries. What is clear is that Seattle's bioterrorist population... Banner man. <laughs> Pretty lame, right? Found the victim. Definitely the work of a conduit. It's very showy. Okay, I need you to take a couple pictures of the crime scene and send them to me. Anything that might give us a lead. Okay, sending you the picture, but I think he blinked. There's your wounds. What kind of power did this? Fire blast or. Lasers. Ooh, what about flesh-eating death gaze? <laughs> I wouldn't mind absorbing a little flesh-eating death gaze, right? Delson, even if the guy who did this is a prime conduit, we still don't know if this power transfer thing's even gonna work. Well, you know what? If it does, my first victim is gonna be the guy who came up with the name Bannerman. Bro, we can still let that go. Uh, Reg, I'm hearing sirens, man. Yeah, let me check real quick. The DUP's just cordoned off the area. I've warned the Seattle PD to stay away. It has to be the conduit. I'll check it out. Jeez, you were right. The place is crawling with dupes. Really want to catch this guy. So their reputation's on the line here. Yeah, well, so it's is mine. Get the fire, no, it's get the conduit! Ease! And good luck with that. That was awesome! You know what they say about secondhand smoke? Thank you. 
Well, this conduit sure got a certain style. Kind of nouveau sick. Okay, I just need... Let me guess, face and wounds. If it's not too much trouble. All right, there you go. Stand by for wounds. No need. I got a hit on the face. Guy's a drug dealer. Rap sheet's a mile long. Look around for his stash. Might give us a clue why the sniper chose him. Holy sh Holy what? What holy? Delson, are you okay? Yeah. Found our sniper going after him. Be careful. Real original advice. Wait, 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 wait. Don't. It's okay. It's okay. I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. Would you slow down? I'm not going to hurt you. Yeah, especially if you don't slow down. Stop! Come back! You get him? No, he ran fast, like, like really, really fast, conduit fast, man. Screw flesh-eating death gaze. I want that. Now don't be greedy. Well, one thing this place tells us is that our sniper is a sniperette. Wait, what? You should see this, Reg. It's like the girliest sniper's nest you've ever seen. What? What does that even mean? I, I don't know. It's just girled up. Girl stuff. Like the name Brent burned into the wall in girly handwriting. And it is definitely the best smelling assassin's den you could ever be in. Okay. Uh, look, just send me photos of anything you think might help. I wonder who Brent is. I can't help you there. Okay, I can see how you might think those are women's shoes. Yeah, they're like size negative. Like, seriously? A serial killer who reads Jane Eyre? Oh, totally. Jane Eyre is like the female catcher in the rye. Okay, those definitely very likely belong to a woman. Like you know. So, anything else interesting? Relax, I'm looking. I guess this counts as interesting. That's interesting, all right. You know, it's a long shot, but maybe if I run this through the database, cross-referencing the name Brent, I'll get lucky. You know, if I had smoke and lasers, I could, like... Put on light shows in our living room. Oh, that'd be putting your powers to good use. Hey, Reg, I was, uh, I was just thinking about the bras. Well, stop, okay? Seriously, just stop. Okay, I'm thinking, when I get to Augustine, it's gonna be like, boom, smoke, and then once I got on the ropes, it's like, zap, zap, I'll whip out the laser show. Well, good to have a plan. Hey, I got a hit on the photo. Name's Brent Walker. One arrest two years ago for minor drug possession. Get this, found dead two months later in an alley. Cause of death, a single puncture wound of unknown origin through the chest. I'm sending you the address now. Yeah, our girls definitely got a thing against drug dealers. <sighs> sure seems like it. It's weird though, man. If she's just killing drug dealers, then why do the news reports make it sound like she's picking off random victims like it could be anybody? Yeah. Well, you'd think the DUP would want people to know the killings weren't random. That if you're not a drug dealer, you're not in danger. That'd sure bring the panic level down. So you're saying, what, the DUP is trying to scare people? I mean, their job is to control the panic.
All right, I'm at the alley, but there's a bunch of heavily armed dudes here. Looks like a drug deal's going down. I hate to go all cop on you, but it is the duty of every citizen to step up when they witness a crime in progress. So... You want me killing people? Delson, I heard shots. Did you kill them? Hey, I was trying to do my duty as a citizen, man, but they were trying to do their duty as criminals. Fretch, you should see this man. Speedy gone crazy is a tagger. She's a pretty damn good one too. Yeah, well, don't forget she's admit, a murderer. Girl makes a mean right? vortex. Pretty damn good one too. She sets a lovely altar. It's actually kind of touching. Yeah, well, there's good touching and bad touching. And now we come to the highlight of the tour. Okay, that is full bore crazy. Okay, so the girl stops off for takeout, comes here to sit with Neon Brent to tell him all about her day while she chowders down. And you know, Olaf's has a location on Alaskan Way. He's supposed to have one of the biggest neon signs in the city. Hey, if I had neon powers and a chowder Jones, that's where I'd hang. I'm on my way.